Hey everyone, it's EJ with Cryptography, where we unlock crypto for the masses. Today we're looking at AntShares, or as it'll be called in Q3 of 2017, NEO. So what is NEO? It's often described as China's Ethereum. It's an open source blockchain, which means that it encourages collaboration and contribution from developers around the world. Additionally, they're piloting something they call Smart Contracts 2.0, and it can be described as a multi-language contract compiler. And that sounds complicated, but all it actually means is that it doesn't matter if you write in Java, .NET, C Sharp, it'll translate all of that into their own native smart contract language, which means that Neo, right off the bat, has access to the world's developers without them having to learn anything new, which is really important. Additionally, one of the most controversial things in the crypto space right now is how you settle transactions. You can have proof of work, which means you have a really expensive algorithm to solve to prove that you're right, or proof of stake, which means you have to throw a lot of money at the problem to basically show that you have the right interest. Well, NEO's solution to that is what they're calling Delegated Byzantine Fault Tolerance, or DBFT. And all it is is that you have two different types of people on the platform. You have the users, like you and I, who engage in the applications, as well as the delegates, who are the people who are there to make money. And they're the people who have the right interest of the ecosystem and are delegated by NEO to confirm each individual transaction. Next, you have two different types of coins with NEO. You have currently Ant shares and Ant coins. You buy Ant shares on your exchange right now, be it Bitrex or anywhere else, and Ant coins are what you actually use to engage with the platform, with the application, the functional token, kind of like gas in Ethereum. What's important to note about both of these is that there's a fixed supply of 100 million of both. And although these are indivisible, which means you can't break them up into smaller tokens, these coins can be. And why should you be interested in Ant shares or NEO? Well, first off, they have government support. Currently in China, they're using their blockchain to map real world assets. Additionally, they have a cross chain patent, which allows them to work across different blockchains. We could see them working with Bitcoin or Ethereum in the future, which is pretty cool. And finally, they've got some really strong partnerships from enterprise people like Microsoft to newer, smaller ICOs like Bancor and Agrella. As always, this is cryptography. We encourage your, your collaboration and contribution, and we would love to hear from you guys. Thanks.